I can't believe you dyed your hair. What did Dad say? Well, he suggested it. I think he's having some sort of midwife crisis. Anyway, you still haven't told me. How was the Bahamas? <laughs> it was crazy. Rob? Yeah? There's a window open, but there's no car in the drive. You know, Johnny, I think you're learning. No one said that to me since first grade. I don't think anyone's home. Excellent. Let's go around the back. There's a window open. Mm. I'll wait at the front door. What kept you? Don't ask. Right. Now we're looking for anything small or valuable we can easily carry or conceal. What is small and valuable that you can easily carry or conceal? Wallets, handbags, jewellery. What a mess! Who lives like this? Uh, George X. Thompson? Put that down. Let's see what they've got. Hmm, what have they got? Oh, oh. <coughs> what is it? I don't know, but it sm oh, smells like a dead pet. <coughs> hello? Oh, hello, I'm calling from Affordable Phones. I was wondering, is this the Thompson residence? Yes, yes. Excellent. We are, have a wonderful offer here from Affordable Phones. We are guaranteed to beat your current provider's charges by up to 10%. Get lost. Just, no, don't no, wait. So, where do you keep your valuables? So, any hidden nest eggs? What have we? Jackpot! Rob!
you'd be stupid enough to come to a place you're not supposed to be in and park your car outside. Come out, George, or I'll call the police. I just came to get my stuff. You shouldn't even have keys to this place anymore. You don't have a right to anything in this house. It's nice to see you keep me clean. Yeah, well you try keeping things under control when you've got a three-year-old running around. How is Gracie? You do not get to ask that. Remember? You walked out on her? You left? I left. You practically kicked me out the door. Oh, don't start with this rubbish again. You were never committed to being a father. You weren't committed to being a family. Being a family meant you couldn't hang out with your friends, <laughs> spend my money on shoes. And have stupid conversation about TV shows that have- Oh, get out! I do not have to deal with this. Just go. Please, just leave. You're fine, kick me out the door again. Stupid. <laughs> bag. What? My bag, it's gone. It was right here. Well, that must be worth a bit. I don't care where you put your bag or what you've got in it. Just leave. Fine. Hello, it's Sarah speaking. Can I help you? Uh, yes, I've I'm I'm a door to door salesman. I've got these bags for sale. They're they're wonderful. They've got uh, zips and pockets, and uh, all for one hundred and twelve ninety nine. I've already got one of those, only cost me fifteen dollars. Uh okay, I'll I'll try somewhere else. Thank you. Bye. What? You won the Blue Waffles Rehab Clinic's raffles major prize. The car? That's right. <laughs> um when can I get it and where do I pick it up from? Just take the raffle ticket down to the Silver Diamond car dealership on Red Hill Road and they'll sort it all out for you. Uh, sorry, where was that? Silver Diamond... Uh... The Silver Diamond car dealership on Red Hill Road. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. No worries. Congratulations. Uh, the ticket. I really got to clean this place up. Small and easy to carry. You've done well, Johnny. Thanks. Where are you going? I'm sick of all this walking. I'm going to go get a car. <laughs> 